Ooh. Hey, what's up you guys, DJ Mama here, and welcome to a deck profile. So this deck profile is heavily based on ygopro.deck.com, aka ygopro deck. Um, they released an article about Gishki Sprite, a, a deck I've definitely played a few more times than once. <laughs> so I decided to bring it to a local. Uh, I'm recording this a few days after the local, so round one I had a buy. Round two I fought against Infernoble Knight and uh, didn't uh, play right, and I got O2'd uh, <laughs> versus uh, Infernoble Knight because I also opened up no sprites. Very fun. Round three I fought against Kashtira, who bricked, so I went 2-1 uh, or 2 uh, overs of them. And unfortunately, I went to time uh, and drew and went 1-1, one, one, a draw, versus a Yosenju player who went second and double Lava Golem'd me <laughs> and Dark Ruler'd me. So, is what it is. But let's go over this deck that uh, YGO Pro uh, recommends you play. Some ratios I obviously doesn't uh, disagree with, but it is what it is. Let's just start out with the Gishki package. We're playing <laughs> 2 Naramaya. That's right, two Nary Mana. Uh, it's a we. I don't know if we're really gonna plan to summon this more than once, but uh, it's there's a way to do it. Next up, Gishki Abyss. So yep, Gishki Abyss, two of them. Uh, we only nearly need two, but uh, this is the way to do it. Next up, three Gishki Grimes. I get it. Uh, Gishki Grimes, one of the best cards, but sometimes its lock does hurt you when you're going second. So. You rather prefer, I prefer you see more sprites than Gishkis. Next up, two Gishki Vision to search the ritual monster, and two Shadow to search the spell, the ritual spell. That's our ratio of main deck Gishkis. Next up, our lovely three copies of Focused Aquamere. I hope this, this deck gets a rarity bump because we have two really good cards being common is really rough. Uh, actually, we have three if you include Nekomir. We're playing Nekomir. It does do stuff going second, uh, but our deck isn't really gonna be focused on going second, according to uh, uh, Yu Prec. But it is a good article. I love it. Uh, love this deck. We're playing Aquamir, and we're also playing Aquamir Illusion. So if you remember, uh, you if you activate Focused Aquamir, you can banish Focused Aquamir to set Aquamir Illusion, which will summon a Gishki ritual monster from your hand, it can attack and it's also returned to the hand during man phase. So, uh, Neremias already sum uh, <laughs> uh, returns to hand on its the gate, so summoning it back uh, with Aquamir Illusion is very good, but I think we only need to see one uh, Neremias, so... <laughs> I actually like, now I like the uh, the one, only doing it uh, once. I only, So I like, sadly, I do like these ratios of uh, I'm playing ones, playing this maybe two Aquamir, and we can play Photomir instead. But I think either Aquamir or Necomir, depending on your preference, works. And Aquamir uh, Illusion can be a side card if you want to do more than one Nerimana summon. But I get it. I get why we're doing it. Uh, they want us to play the Gishkis in this Gishki sprite list, but. I think at least summoning Naramayanus is a uh, still Gishki sprite. So that's the Gishki part of the deck. I'll put it out all out there once uh, once it's out there. But next up, the sprite and the hand trap lineup. So of course, uh, let me just uh, go through all this. Sorry, just a little pause. Next up, the sprite parts. Of course, we're playing three sprite blue. There he is three blues of course we're only playing two jet once again according to ygopro.deck.com uh, one red and one carrot i usually i like playing three jet just seeing him is a really really good next up all the only two starter we're allowed to play a smashers and of course the i'm trying to make a room see if i can fit it i can fit it right about here the double cross Yep, we're playing Double Cross. Love to see that. So there's our sprite lineup. I could go for either Jet or maybe Pixies could help. I'm I'm trying kind of leaning toward maybe playing Pixies and Gamma Burst. 
because they're not too bad. But that's uh, this is probably just the minimum. Next up, speaking of minimums, only two Swat Frog. Uh, we don't really need to play the third, I guess. I guess it's a it's a little rough. If you do the Toad line, it's whatever. Next up, three Nimble Beaver uh, into only two Nimble Angler. So unfortunately, you don't get to see the the big combo of Swat Frog Pitch Nimble Angler. Uh, which is like almost near an FGK in Sprite, but yeah, and then our hand trap lineup is three imperm three triple tech. That's it. <laughs> so It's a little light on hand traps and I'd like I can I obviously want to cut more of the gishkis if you want to put more uh, hand traps like ash and droll and things like that uh, This is also 41 cards total. So if we put it all together it's 41, and uh, I really sometimes don't like going for 40. Yeah, I don't really like going over 40. You can cut, obviously, some of the Gishki stuff and uh, supplement into either Ash or Droll into this. Triple Attack is also maybe a cut, because you're not always going first if you don't win the die roll lock. I usually didn't. So that's the whole list of 40, 41 plus... And then I'll get to the extra deck, which had some choices from uh, my Geo Pro. There were definitely choices. Uh, <laughs> I don't recommend, obviously, a lot of it, but I'll show you what I did and what I prefer. Uh, I definitely prefer <laughs> what I did, but I, I definitely gave it a try with uh, this extra deck. All right, well, all right. So. Their extra deck recommendation. I'm just gonna try and go over this. So, oh, right. They started with the one, the only, the Zeus man. We are, we have a Zeus lines for sure. Uh, they were playing Toad. That's correct. Uh, Mannequin Cat, very funny card. They're playing Onibimaru. Here's Gigantic Sprite, Herald of Pure Light, Ninja Mosquito, then we have some links like Unicorn, Dark, Bujinji Asahima to make Toad with the one Swap Frog in hand and one in Grave. We have Sprind, and we have IP. Oh. We are playing two Gigantic Sprite. Almost forgot. Always gotta play two. And then, what am I missing here? Okay, I also almost forgot the Avermax. So, instead, they had a uh, Gustav Max as the 15th card, but I'm like, the only way we're making Gustav Max is if we actually summon two Nerimanas. And with all my time playing this deck, you probably just want to play one <laughs> and it's going to be hard to summon it. So I replaced it with the, just a downard just to make Zeus more live because that's the higher rank XC we should be focusing on. <laughs> so that's the 15 card extra. Uh, yeah, it's a, it's a deck. So it, instead of Gustav Max, obviously I would, I recommend downard over Gustav. And then that's uh 15 for sure and then it gave some side deck preferences it only gave us five cards so you can play vanity uh on the gishki side anyway gishki vanity gishki zelgegas and gishki photomir if you want to pay five thousand for nerimanas which is a steep cost but i get it we can also play coral and enemy for more extension but it locks you into waters and that's not what sprite wants to do and you can play spiritual water aoi uh if you end on enough waters but you usually don't <laughs> uh, but yeah, uh, let's go over the actual side deck. These came in always. Ash. Uh, next up, uh, Droll. Sorry. Droll's very good. I never really activated it, but I still definitely saw it. Uh, Nibiru. Two Nibiru. Definitely fine. Uh, a Called By. That's something this deck was missing, even with 41 cards. Dark Rulers, always good. 
the one Harpy's Feather Duster and then two Lightning Storm. You can either, you can probably put a Cosmic Cyclone if you're still scared of Runic. Um, yeah, so ygeopro.deck.com. Uh, I think the main deck is all right. It's definitely not what I recommend, but I think you, uh, it's something because I went, what, one win, one loss, one draw, and a, a, the buy. So I get two, one, one. It's uh, not too terrible, but it's certainly something. Uh, yeah, I I actually do recommend cutting down on the Gishkis cards and putting in more hand traps because uh, I definitely went second and I felt a little lost <laughs> during those games because now I have to do it uh, going second and this I have to rely on like triple tack to get me through triple tack and imperm just for the interruption is a uh, not as great as you kind of want but hopefully you guys enjoyed i will see you guys next time uh please check out the article i'll link it down below and i will see you guys in the next one bye